From the KATC Weather Lab, here's Eric's forecast. Happy Friday and happy official start of Festival International Weekend and the weather cannot be more perfect all weekend long. Just sunny skies, pleasant temperatures. Get out there, soak it all up. Make sure you have the sunblock though and are drinking the water before maybe clouds and the chance for showers return into next week. Take a look outside today. Just a beautiful spring, late April day. You got the little bit of the northerly breeze blowing, but you can see the flowers are in full bloom now as we move late on into the month and had a couple of those April showers to get those flowers blooming as we get ready to move into the month of May, but you can see plenty of sunshine beaming down and helping those get those flowers going. Take a look at the big picture. We can see sunny skies for much of the southeast, but a big storm system that moved through Thursday, still producing some strong storms back through the northeast, now lifting through DC up into the New York area. That'll continue to lift up and out of there by the weekend. We do have this storm system moving into the Rocky Mountains. That'll lift to the north and could produce some snow across northern portions of the country, but high pressure will be in control for us, creating just an absolutely fantastic weekend locally. You can see not a cloud in the sky, at least on the radar. We did have some of those puffy cumulus clouds developing earlier this afternoon, but with that northerly breeze, very comfortable. Temperatures began the day in the low to mid 60s. We have made our way into the lower 80s with all that sunshine. Many areas, though, staying in the upper 70s, but once that sun goes down, temperatures will begin to cool off quickly. So as Rob mentioned, if you're heading out to festival a little later on tonight, you can see those temperatures quickly will be falling down into the lower 70s by 8 o'clock. And then if you're going to be out there all evening long, getting closer to the 10, 11 o'clock down into those mid 60s. So as mentioned, you might want to have that light jacket or at least a sweater to bring with you to throw on as temperatures begin to cool off into the evening. High pressure will be pretty much over top the region, keeping us cleared. But as mentioned, there's that possibility for some snow moving through the northern portions up towards Chicago by tomorrow afternoon, but we'll continue to have that southerly flow helping to push all that moisture up to the north and away from us. Just plenty of sunshine into the weekend. That system then brings the snow into the Great Lakes region and into the northeast. High pressure continues to be right over top, keeping that front up to the north. So another sun filled afternoon by Sunday. Eventually by Monday, the high pressure begins to slide off to the east and we do start to see some clouds starting to work their way back into to Acadiana, but it does look like we stay dry even into the first half of next week. It might not be till Thursday before we finally see some rain return to the area. Temperatures this evening will be getting on the cool side by tomorrow morning. Low the mid 50s to get our Saturday started. But with a sun filled afternoon, those temperatures like today quickly rebound, getting into the upper 70s to near 80 degrees for us here in Lafayette. Just a pitcher perfect day across the area. Heading into Sunday morning with a few clouds around, not as cool, but some upper 50s to lower 60s, and then another great day with temperatures into those lower 80s by Sunday afternoon. So here's your full festival forecast tonight. Pleasant, clear temperatures cooling quickly, getting down to about the upper 60s by 8, 9 o'clock. Tomorrow afternoon, nonstop sunshine. Make sure you have the sunblock and hats ready. 81 degrees for that high. Another great evening tomorrow. Not as cool, but still will be very comfortable to be out enjoying the late night activities. And then for your Sunday, just absolutely fantastic weather to close things out. Maybe a few more clouds around and temperatures a degree or two warmer into those low to mid 80s. We keep the nice weather into next week, but you do start to see slow rain chances returning as the humidity makes its way back into Acadiana. More or less going to be your very isolated stray activity Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Wednesday, little better rain chances as we push into Thursday will bump it up to about 40%, but you do see after that rain chances only stay around 30 into next weekend with temperatures very spring like as we move into early May into those 80s, but you can see get out there, soak up that sunshine and have a wonderful festival international weekend. Don't go away. We'll have more news after the break.